All right, guys. Danny here from the Wandering Wedlocks, and this is the showdown between Verizon and T-Mobile. And I think <clears throat> you guys will be definitely shocked by the winner. Okay, we are in Sugar City, Colorado, in Fowler and Ordway, uh, right around that area. Very, very secluded rural area. I'm going to go ahead and turn on the Verizon, um, the uh, jetpack, and tell you how many bars I see. We have four out of five bars, four out of five bars. Actually, no, three, three out of five bars right now. Three out of five bars. So it's toggling in between four bars. Oh, there it is. Four bars and three bars, okay? Three out of four, I mean. So it's toggling in between three to four, uh, to full bars, okay? Now let's go ahead and take a look at another Verizon device. This is their this is their phone and you can see let me go back here that this is two bars two out of five bars two out of five bars now it's still 4G but you're getting two bars out of five for their phone now let's go ahead and take a look at T-Mobile T-Mobile and there's my dog T-Mobile is constantly at uh, full bars, five bars. So T-Mobile in Sugar City wins again. I don't know if I posted the other video, but this is the same thing that happened in, um, what was it, Pike, uh, Pike, what is it? National Forest. Pike National Forest. T-Mobile had three to uh, three to four bars, and Verizon had one less. So there it is, guys. Two cities, and T-Mobile is definitely beating. I'm gonna go ahead and continue this competition as we move forward, and let you guys know which one is better. But as of right now, T-Mobile is beating Verizon hands down, and including the cost, they're getting six stars out of five. Congratulations to T-Mobile for these two cities.